Aloha's, the Moon Goddess Oracle. We are back. All right, I just finished up with the uh, Sagittarius for the 2019 uh, Look Ahead reading. I apologize. A card got lost for the Sagittarius, and it was card number seven, um, which is how to achieve your dreams and your goals so for the cross watchers out there and then all of the Sagittarius who did watch the video um your ending was how to achieve your goals was to simply follow you have to go back and watch the video follow everything that I said in that video and then um achieving your goals was basically um focusing on the money and working hard okay that came to me because that car got lost I was like wow okay so I'm going to do the Tauruses. Um, again, this is the 2019 look ahead. Just want to say thank you for all of the likes, the shares, the subscriptions, the donations. Um, I did explain the situation with my PayPal going on. Um, it is me. I had to use the personal account until the business account gets fixed. Um, because they want me to change it to my business name, which is too much. So due to the holidays, PayPal hasn't really been... The whole times are too long and they want to verify all of my paperwork. So it's too much. So... I'll just be using that. I mean, it's still the same picture. Um, I did put it in the link, and it's also linked on my Facebook. And then once the business one gets fixed, it'll I'll probably go back, but it'll probably just be under my business name. And then hopefully that solves that. Um, I'm thinking about setting up a Venmo for people that use Venmo and all that stuff um, in Cash App. So I'll have different ways that you can uh, donate and also pay for your readings because I know it's a hassle. All right, so for the Tauruses, already, <clears throat> and the topic will be the name of the video, okay? So, um, Tauruses, the overall thing for you for the year of 2019 is... I don't want to say isolation because I really 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 um, just don't want to use that word so I'm going to go with what's a word I can describe this uh, I don't want to say isolation I will just go with awakening okay um so i'm so sorry so taurus is yes you're gonna have some um that's gonna be your overall theme there's gonna be a couple of things that come your way that's going to awaken you waken you up okay um it's not necessarily that you need to be isolated in order for that to happen um but there's gonna be a lot of things that will awaken your um, your spirit, awaken your thoughts, just um, awaken your achievements. There will be so, so many things going on for you, but that is your theme. That is your theme for the month of 2019, okay? I'm doing a spread, so there are seven cards total, and so, yeah. So, I'm going in the order that the cards came out in. So, awakening is your overall theme, the main theme for 2019. And some energies that you'll be departing from for 2018. Um, it looks like you will be departing from a lot of female energy, all right? Whether that be, um, you know, your mother, whether that be siblings, uh, whether they even be your children. It looks like you are um, separating from feminine energy, um, you don't want the the interference. You don't want interference of your goals and of your um, the passions that you have, which will hopefully that will be revealed here. Um, but from 2018, it looks like the feminine energies really drove you crazy. Um, you you feel that it caused you to not be so focused on the dreams and goals that you should have been focused on, okay? So that is definitely what your departing um, energy is. Um, and it looks like your talents that you're going to be expressing is... Ruling, okay. So you have the talent to just be the ruler of things be the overseer of things you're not going to be more so of the doer you're going to be over the people 
and you're going to be watching them do pretty much. So you're going to be the person in charge and giving orders this year, basically. Um, you're not letting people boss you around, so you're sitting on the other side of that. Um, I see you being as a, a very stern, um, very abrupt even st still so, and then, you know, um, kind of watching and being aware of your surroundings, not letting people uh, push over on you, um, definitely keeping all of the, the snakes behind you, keeping everybody, um, I mean, you pretty much ain't even watching your back because you're just saying it like that. I'm not even scared, pretty much, all right? So that's going to be a talent that you're going to reveal that, you know, you are, um, you're going to be the one in that seat, all right? And people going to have to listen to you whether they like it or not. Um, in your future opportunities, um, I see love for you, Taurus. I see love for you. Um, I'm also seeing an opportunity to be given birth. I'm also seeing the opportunity to relocate. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Birth and relocation are the opportunities that will come about for you this year, Taurus. So be looking out for that, okay? And then some upcoming obstacles, all right? So you're going to have like a lot of choices, um, a lot of... Um, a lot of things kind of coming your way, um, and you just simply need to make the decision. You pretty much can go wherever you want. Um, you can do whatever you want to do. So when the opportunity arises, just know that you will be the one um, booking the flight. Will there be some bumps and bruises along the way? Yes, because simply people just don't like to see other people prosper. Keep that in mind, okay? But you have that as an op op upcoming um, obstacle. All right, and in the fifth position, how you're going to deal with that is being nice to your friends, okay? Keeping you, having your friends along the side beside you for the tag along, pretty much. I'm um, giving your friends the opportunity to prosper as well. You may want to introduce um, some ideas to your friends, and um, you know, see what you guys can come up together from there. That would be a great um, way to overcome the previous obstacles of other people trying to interfere with what you have going on. Because again, people do not want to see you prosper. Is what I'm seeing. All right. And then um, number seven, how to achieve your goals and dreams is watching your energy. I like that you got that. Watching your energy, okay? Being aware of who you keep in your circle, watching your surroundings. I cannot stress that enough for you, Taurus, because that's what it looks like. Your overall, again, your overall theme is um, uh, not, again, not isolation, but pretty much just you know, you're going to have to watch and you may lose some friends, Taurus. I hate to say it that way, but you may lose you. Matter of fact, you are. You're going to lose some friends this year, Taurus. Yeah. But that's okay because you don't need them in order to treat, to achieve your dreams and your goals and your aspirations, okay? Because you're going to meet like-minded people throughout the year who are going to be on the same journey with you. So you definitely, losing the friends may seem like a distraught thing, but it's definitely not. All right. Taurus, that is your year ahead for 2019. All right, if you want to book a personal reading, you can do so on the website. Um, feel free to donate to support the channel um, via PayPal link. It will be in the description box, okay? All right, we'll keep the readings rocking. Next up is going to be, because these readings I didn't do for the December, it's going to be Libra. Libra, you're up next. Until next time, bye.